morning students uh, this is the work workspace for fluid sim so now uh, i'm going to um, uh, have a new file so this is the work phase where we are going to create our circuit uh, this is the library toolbar in which we will be having uh, pneumatics hydraulics and other systems now we are going to design a hydraulic system so we are going for hydraulics uh, our aim is to uh, actuate a single acting cylinder so i am going to have a single acting cylinder like this uh, it should be spring written so by right clicking it i can able to change its property go to property here we will be having many icons i am going for configure cylinder and in that i am going to click spring return at the right side and click ok you don't care about the other details i will let you know afterwards now for uh, controlling this actuator i am going to uh, have one direct control valve directional control valve as it is a um, single acting cylinder i am going to have a uh, 3 by 2 way valve 3 by 2 way valve okay now uh, for uh, supplying i am going to have a pump as it is a hydraulic i will be using a fixed displacement pump the pump should take water or the fluid from a tank so i am using a tank i will be using two more tanks at the required places i will show where i am going to use okay now uh, i am going to have a pressure relief valve to make the excess water to be drained um, into the tank okay uh, in the workspace i can move the component wherever i wish like this i can able to move wherever i wish now uh, wherever i want to rotate i can able to rotate by right clicking it i can able to rotate like this okay okay now the two tanks will be coming in the position of here and another one is it's not matching yet no not not yet now it is okay now i'm going to move this tank from here to here okay all my components are ready i'm and i'm going to join the components using pipelines if you want to have at exact location you just have a click left click you will be able to connect dcb and single acting cylinder in similar fashion again i am going to now connect the pump and dcb over ok now i am going to connect uh, again able to move this pipeline also uh, the last component i am going to connect is the pressure relief valve ok now now my component now my circuit is ready to do the simulation work so we do the simulation okay so this is my tank from the tank the pump will pump the liquid and it is controlled by a dcv and it is uh, pumped into the single acting cylinder so that i am expecting the cylinder to actuate this is my circuit simple circuit once the um, uh, extension stroke gets over uh, the um, spring will retract the piston back to its original position the water will drain into the tank the excess water will be um, uh, drained into the tank using a pressure relief valve this is the working of this circuit ok shall we go so to simulate is to simulate this um, circuit uh, there is a um, play like option start in the toolbar you have to just press that one so uh, i'm going to actuate 
the DCV, my cylinder is actuated, my cylinder is made to extend. Now I am going to leave the push button so that it will retract. Yeah, so this is how a yeah, single acting cylinder rotates. Hope you all have understood. Thank you.